My dear Reliance family, a very good evening to each one of you. Today is the Reliance family day. We have come together to celebrate the birthday of our founding chairman, Dhirubhai Ambani. With the passage of time, our family is becoming bigger and bigger. But we will always remain Dhirubhai's family. We will always cherish his timeless family values. And these are integrity, excellence, empathy, the spirit of cooperation and the commitment to make every tomorrow better than every today for one and all. These values are encapsulated in Reliance's We Care philosophy. We care for the planet and humanity. We care for our mother India and every single Indian. Friends and colleagues, for me, it has been my life's honor to lead Reliance for over two decades now. If leading Reliance is my pride, working with all of you has been my privilege. You are an army of immensely talented individuals who work wonders day in and day out with grit and discipline. I am proud of each and every one of you. You are my perpetual recharge battery. Each single day, you renew my enthusiasm, boost my energy and validate the purpose for which our founder established Reliance. I am deeply grateful to each and every one of you for your contribution to Reliance. My dear Reliance family, today the domestic and global environment for businesses are changing very fast. There is simply no room for complacency. Reliance was never complacent in the past and Reliance will never be complacent in the future. We are known for disrupting the market through constant innovation and reinvention. We have shown the courage to set the bar high and the ability to jump even higher to create new records. This is how Reliance has achieved perennial growth and that is how we will remain true to our motto, growth is life. Let us follow this winning formula with greater confidence and consistency. Dear friends, as India races ahead to become the world's third largest economy, an unprecedented opportunity awaits Reliance. Reliance can and Reliance will grow to be among the top 10 business conglomerates of the world. For this, we need to be laser focused on three things. One, we must always provide extreme value to our customers. We must unfailingly exceed their expectations through collaboration and systems improvement. Our efforts have won us unprecedented customer love for all our businesses over the years. In the coming years, we must continue to strive even harder to develop products and services that no one has created ever before. We must continue to delight the customers and reinforce their belief that Reliance provides immense value to their lives. Two, all our actions must always win community trust. Dhirubhai has taught us that continuously winning the trust of the communities that we operate in is an essential part of our business. Trust is that hard won intangible asset that transforms commerce into culture. Trust elevates a momentary business transaction to an enduring heart to heart relationship. Through all our businesses and through the rapidly expanding activities of Reliance Foundation, let us make Reliance the number one corporate on the parameter of customer love and community trust. Three, for enhancing customer love and community trust, we must continuously enrich competencies and capabilities at the individual level, the team level and the business level and at the organizational level. Businesses grow exponentially when individuals and teams 
display clarity of goals and flawless execution. When all our businesses grow exponentially, we can contribute more to India's inclusive prosperity and make the world a better place. My dear friends, in three days from now, we will say goodbye to 2023 and usher in 2024. As the head of the Reliance family, I would like to share with all of you three more key messages for the new year. Let me summarize them as three consolidations. First, let us consolidate Reliance's place among global leaders in digital platforms, data and AI adoption. Second, let us consolidate Reliance's place among global leaders in talent enrichment. And third, let us consolidate Reliance's place among global leaders in institutional culture. Let me elaborate. First, about AI adoption. As Reliance reinvents itself to become a unique new age technology company, we need to boldly embrace data and AI to become better at decision making and resource utilization. In the era of digital platforms, data has become a new factor of production along with talent and money. We need to be at the forefront of using data with AI as an enabler for achieving quantum jump in productivity and efficiency.